Welcome or welcome back, Cyber Explorers. It's Alfie, and in this video we'll explore together with this step-by-step -step guide how to check if your PC supports HVCI in Windows. So without further ado, let's get right into it. To check if your PC supports HVCI, Hypervisor Protected Code Integrity, you can verify support using Windows Security Settings, Open Settings, Windows Key Plus I, then Privacy, and Security then Windows Security and open Windows Security. Click Device Security, then Core Isolation Details. Look for Memory Integrity, if listed. Your system supports HVCI. If it's off, try enabling it. If it fails to turn on, your system may have incompatible drivers or unsupported hardware. Microsoft also provides a dedicated tool called HVCIScan.exe to check for driver and hardware compatibility with HVCI. It's available for Windows 10, 11, and Server Editions. HVCI Requirements To support and enable HVCI, your system must meet the following. UEFI Firmware with Secure Boot Enabled. Hardware Virtualization, Intel VTX, or AMD V. SLAT. Second Level Address Translation, Intel EPT, or AMD RVI. TPM 2.0 is recommended for full feature support. Compatible drivers, incompatible kernel mode drivers, may prevent HVCI from functioning. Older CPUs may emulate some features using restricted user mode, but this can lead to performance degradation. And that's it for today. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, consider subscribing, and don't forget to activate the notification bell so you won't miss out on any new uploads. Thank you for watching, until next time, see you later.